We have a treat for you guys. We're going to go through many of the Avengers Marvel blue chip keys, take a look at their high grade sales and see how they compare from when the MCU first came out until their most recent sale. Hit the subscribe button. We're taking you back in time to when these characters first showed up in theaters. We have Journey 83. 9.4, 2012 going for $222,200, and this week now going for 432 grand. And keep in mind the Thor movie debuted in 2011, so that first sale was almost a year after its debut. But we're going to take it back a little bit further to Tales of Suspense 39, a CGC 9.2, the first appearance of Tony Stark, Iron Man. Now, in 2008, the movie came out, the first movie of the MCU that would set off the events over the next decade. Back then, in 2008, sold for $35,000. The most recent sale, 2021, sold for $144,000. Then we have an 8.5 of The Incredible Hulk. We're taking you back to just a little after 2008-ish, the first appearance of Edward Norton Hulk. Well, there was a 8.5 that sold in 2011, went for $55,000. And in 2022, the first appearance of Bruce Banner has hit 245K. All right, guys. Now, remember, she's a founding Avenger in the MCU. Natasha Romanoff, the Black Widow. She first appeared in Tales of Suspense 52, and we have a CGC 9.4 sale to take a look at. Now, remember, she first debuted in Iron Man 2 back in May of 2010. That same year, her first appearance in a 9.4 sold for $3,002. Fast forward to this year, 2022, that same 9.4 sells for $29,500. Then we have the first appearance of Hawkeye in Tales of Suspense 57. We have him debuting in Thor 2011 and since then starring in his own series on Disney+. Plus. So I expect these numbers to be outstanding. Back in 2011, a 9-4 of this book went for 5,700. Fast forward to 2021, last sale put it at 16,800. That's not too shabby, but let's talk about the Avengers as a whole. The movie debuted in 2012. Avengers issue one in a CGC 9.6 a few years after in 2015 would go to sell for $215,100. Flash forward to 2021, that same book in that same grade sold for $369,000. And if you are subscribed to Key Collector Comics, you have already gotten this alert because we had a major record breaker that happened this week for a comic that hasn't sold since 2019, Captain America number one. Now, regardless of if the first Captain America movie came out in 2011, the last time a 9.4 Captain America one came to market in 2019, it sold for $915,000. And over this last week, that book in that grade hit 3.12 million dollars hot damn now we only touched on a few characters which characters specifically new ones do you think are benefiting the most from showing up in the mcu what books will make this list the next time